consider the case of a large mass on a table that has no friction and a lesser mass over a pulley pulling it. Now it will cause that to accelerate. The large mass we'll call big M, the little mass little m. Now the first thing we need to do is draw the forces acting on uh, each mass. So the little mass m is obviously pulled downwards by gravity. So it has a weight, mg, pulling down. Opposing that is a tension in the string. Uh, it, there, as it pulls down, uh, it'll pull against large mass m, and large mass m will pull back on little mass m, and the tensions are exactly the same. It's one string over a, a pulley, and the tensions are the same. So what we need to do is isolate each system and find the F equals MA equations. They will accelerate. Both masses will accelerate at exactly the same rate. They're connected by the string. So let's isolate the mass on the table. Look through a window, get rid of the other one, and just say, let's look at this one situation and apply F net equals MA. Now when we look at this, we find there's only one force acting. There's no opposing friction. All we see is the tension. So the net force is the tension. That's it. And so I can write capital T, the tension, equals MA. And that is the F equals MA equation describing that mass and that situation. Now we can look at the other one. In this case, I have the weight pulling down and it is a larger force because it's causing an acceleration downward. And I isolate this, what is the F net? Well, it's going to be the larger one mg minus the smaller tension pulling up. And so the net force is mg minus t and it's going to equal ma. So now we found the equation for the little mass, the F uh, equals ma equation for that one. Now let's look at the larger picture, both masses accelerating. Now in this case, uh, the equation will be mg is big M plus little m times a. Now why is that? Well first of all, the only force acting to accelerate those two masses is mg. That's it. Now the two tensions will cancel each other out. They're only uh, there, that string is a connector connecting the two masses. The net force is mg. And the total mass moving is big M plus little m, and so F net equals MA is given by that equation. Now, you need to uh, take some time to see if you can look at that situation and write out the three F net equals MA equations for this situation.